I am Maria Garcia de Fleury. Charles Foucault was born in France in Strasbourg on September 15, 1858. He was orphaned and Charles and his sister were raised by their grandfather. At the age of 14, Charles received his first Holy Communion and his confirmation on April 28, 1872. Charles was intelligent and studies were easy for him. He liked books a lot, but he read anything. Little by little, he grew distant from the faith. He entered the military school and after two years, he was already an officer. At 20 years old, he inherited his grandfather's fortune and dedicated himself to seeking pleasures in food and parties. They called him Fat Foucault. In October 1880, as a soldier, he was assigned to Algeria, but for maintaining an irregular relationship with a woman and rejecting the advice of his superiors, he was dismissed from his position. In 1886, he had a profound conversion experience. Life among the followers of Islam had given him pause, for they took their religion very seriously. He, on the other hand, had lived by wasting money and adventuring. So he began to pray, Lord, if you exist, let me know you. A friend directed him to Father Juvelin. Charles confessed and felt like a new man. As soon as he believed that there was a God, he understood that he could do nothing but live for him. His religious vocation was born at the same time as his faith. On January 28, 1882, at the age of 30, he resigned from the army. Since then, he opted for a very simple life, sleeping on the floor, praying daily for hours. He went as a pilgrim to the Holy Land for four months. Walking through the places of Christ's life, he found his vocation to consecrate himself totally to God, imitating Jesus in a hidden and silent life. He spent several years with the Trappist, first on Our Lady of Snow, then in Akbis in Syria. Later he lived alone in prayer and adoration near the poor clares of Nazareth. He was ordained as a priest in 1901 at the age of 43 and went to the Sahara Desert, first to Beni Abis, then to Tamanraset in the midst of the Tuaregs of Hogar where he settled. From January 1904, he dedicated himself to the evangelization of the nomadic tribe of the Tuaregs. He translated the gospel <clears throat> into Tuareg language. He translated Tuareg po poetry into French. He wrote several books on the Tuaregs, notably a French Tuareg, Tuareg French grammar and dictionary. The Berbers of the desert called him Marabout. The war was tearing Europe apart and had begun to reach the Sahara. On December 1st, 1916, at the age of 58, Charles de Foucault was killed by a rifle shot in the midst of an anti-French revolt by the Berbers of Hogar. Charles de Foucault lived his Christianity as a brother to all, beginning with the smallest. His goal was not to convert others, but to live God's gracious love, putting into practice the apostolate of goodness. That is why he wrote, I want to accustom all Christians, Muslims, Jews, and idolaters to consider me as their brother, the universal brother. On May 15, 2022, Pope Francis canonized St. Charles de Foucault, who tried to live the simple purity of the gospel, because in the gospel is the truth about God, and with God we always win.